Hello everyone, and welcome to this unboxing video for Privateer Press's Mini Crate in the month of July 2018. So, I don't know what this is in advance because I stopped looking or matching up the months, so let's find out. Um, as many of you know, but for people new to this, this is alternate, mar alt mar alternate art models of pre-existing models from the War Machine Hordes game, or at least generally are. I won't be surprised if they start doing other stuff, but I'd be a little disappointed if they start doing Monster Apocalypse. Although it's great that that game's back. All right, so this time we have Faro Brigade War Valkyrie, which I was a little confused by because I thought that was already a pre-existing model, and then I realized, okay, no, the Valkyrie, the Faro Valkyries are something else entirely but, or not entirely, they're a different model, same faction. So the Faro are pig people. Pigs are something else in this world, P-Y-G. And it is based on the Faro Brigand Warlord. Uh, so this is one of the two um, minion factions, um, Gatorman and Faro, or at least the two original. I don't think they've included another one by now. Although I'm willing to bet a third one's coming by the looks of it. Regardless, so that was the artwork earlier. The quote is wonderful. There will be bacon. So the Faro are semi-cannibalistic. They're pretty much doing the equivalency of if we ate primates, except they're a lot closer to their evolutionary brethren. Uh, they, you know, <laughs> they're pig people, not, hey, we're so, no, they're pig people. They're still furry and everything. Some of them aren't that bright still, but they are, their war beasts are pigs, literal pigs, um, with an I, not a Y, and they keep around all sorts of different kind of things, but one of their, their original war engine, uh, which in War Machine Hordes is big giant battle engine kind of stuff, is a, called the Meat Thresher, it's a giant wheel turned by little pigs running it, and because it's hot, they make it hot they turn a heater on and they do this till long not just to get them running they're also cooking them they stop when they're cooked it also has guns on it and then they eat them so they're pigs that eat bacon so um we have a plastic i believe resin like piece for the center um she is a small base i could swear these guys were medium but I could be wrong. No, no, they're not. I think they're war casters are. Or they're pig war caster is. War casters. They have a human war caster. Is, or warlock as well. Um, then we've got one pewter arm with the gun. It also has a shoulder pad. I mention that because the other arm does not have a shoulder pad. And it is also a gun. I could swear one of these was a sword. Nope. She is dual wielding guns. Um, cool. They look like blunderbusses, honest. No, not blunderbusses. Um, I don't know. This setting has a wide range of guns, including ones that don't actually exist for the technology period. But regardless, that appears to be everything in it. Um, this looks like a really interesting model. I wouldn't mind actually painting this. I don't own any Faro, um, but now that you can mix and match them with uh, Gators, I might get more, but it's been that way for at least a year now, whenever Mark III started. Regardless, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, feel free to press the like button. If you think somebody else will enjoy this, please share this video. If you didn't like this video, go ahead and press the dislike button. I won't mind, but please leave a constructive comment as to why. Also, if you want to comment in general, please do. Um, if you want to see specific models that I've unboxed or ask about, or ask because I have a lot of models in general well, that I can paint, um, particularly with Privateer Press, I have a lot. Or if you want to see my thoughts on this and everything, I'm actually starting to run a uh, role-playing game in the setting doing the uh, Mortal module. So if you want to hear thoughts on that, feel free to ask. Regardless, if you want to see more like this, be it other unboxing videos, painting videos, which I try to do on uh, the Privateer Press, something from Grimkin, and the primer got screwed up, so I need to strip that first. Or any of my board game overviews, which I could always do on Undercity or Widower's Wood, feel free to subscribe. Regardless, thank you for watching, and have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.